back guys, GVids here, and today's episode we're going to go over a quick little spot here where we can get some easy fish. Um, you don't need a carcass for this spot since carcass fishing is dead, but if you do want to hit the spot up for yourselves, you're going to want to come to this exact point here. You're going to find these little batches of islands just off the train tracks there, and we're going to be running through the middle of them, and uh, we're going to get a whole bunch of fish. So if there are no fish here, don't worry. Um, you can just take your rod out, and sorry before I say any more, you do want to come here in the night time. Uh, the daytime I found the fish didn't really spawn in as much, but at night they most certainly did. So come here in the night time, that's my first tip. But other than that, if the fish are not in the water for you, like they are for me, I didn't take my rod out yet, I was just running around. Uh, but you just want to take your rod out and they will actually start spawning in for you. I'll do that now just to kind of show you. So once you take your rod out, you'll notice that they started spawning in behind me there. And a little bit more on the point. We got some long nose gar coming out of there. That's awesome. Those are $5 each. Now if you have a friend here with you, you can actually give some to your friend as he runs them back and forth. Or if you guys want to bring a cart here, you can also do that. Uh, the carts are kind of a pain in the ass. And I find the freaking things always run away on me when I'm trying to do stuff and I end up losing all my fish anyways or you get griefed and someone kills you when you're on the cart and you lose everything so stay away from the cart either just come back and forth with your horse or two horses you can go and steal a horse and do that that way you can uh, profit a little bit more from the fish I'm not gonna stay here very long to do this stuff here for you I basically just wanted to show you uh, keep the video nice and short so it's not uh, dragged on any longer than it needs to be. And those g long nose are getting out of the water nice and easily. Perfect. A lot of little guys, some bluegills, chain pickerel, and some, uh, what's it called, Blue or bullhead catfish. And they're all worth about 75 cents to a dollar a piece. They got long nose gars, those are five dollars a piece. I will actually bring you guys to the butchers. That's the only part I'll edit this video here, so you don't have to watch me run there. But it's not as heavily populated as uh, the last uh, spot I showed you guys, which I'll actually put a link to that in the comments there if you have not seen that one yet. It is a very juicy spot. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people have known about it. I'm sure a lot of people might know about this one as well. But this method is still working and still working quite well no matter where we go with it. I'm going to try a few more spots later on today and see what I can come up with. But for now guys, uh, I'm going to put this thing on my horsey. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to leave those two there. Come here, horse. So let me guys, let me know guys uh, what you guys thought about this spot here. If uh, you are able to make anything from it. Anyways, I'm going to run down the train tracks to the butchers and I'll meet you guys there. Alright, we made it over to the butchers here. There's another guy here too, that's alright. Looks like he was doing the two horse method as well. So I didn't, uh, I wasn't there for very long. The whole, I was there for again maybe, I don't know, nine minutes or so, just under ten minutes. So I, I didn't spend a whole lot of time there. Most of my time was talking and basically showing you guys what to do. So if you didn't do that, cut some few minutes off there and this is what you're going to get just in a few minutes. Again, you can stay there longer. I just didn't want to for video's sake, but if you stay there longer, you obviously can bring in a lot more fish to the butchers and make it worthwhile, plus do some hunting to make even more money on the trip. But anyways, guys, I really hope you liked this spot. Uh, if you did, make sure you share, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.